If you work out in this heat, it can be unbearable, but for some folks, it's actually working out as a positive right now. Channel 5 Stephanie Rosados joins us live from Lyford. And Stephanie, how is this weather helping farmers? Rudy, while it may be hot, some farmers are taking advantage of the weather because it's working in favor of harvesting season and it's helping crop fields like the one behind me. Farmers were harvesting out here today around 100 acres. Grain harvesting season is off to a great start. But it's, it's good harvest weather. Lupe Arguyin harvests both grain sorghum and corn. While some farmers are hoping for a break in the heat to alleviate tough working conditions. It's a little bit too hot. <laughs> grain farmers say the weather is just right for harvesting. I think we're just on the perfect timing right now. Trying to get this thing out. This Arguyin spent the day harvesting. He says the rain from the string of recent severe weather events helped the grain. The harvest this year quite different from last. It had an impact because it was different. It was a drought at the beginning, then it turned wet at the end. And so farmers had a hard time harvesting their crop due to excessive moisture last year. And right now it's the opposite. We started off dry, wet, then dry again. It's good that we had the water before. You know, we have heat now. Oliver Herrera owns Deep South Transit and helps haul different products like grain sorghum. We haul calabaza, we haul cabbage, we haul green bean. While he says it's a good year for grain, the excessive heat is having a negative impact on produce like watermelon. Here, actually, we didn't haul any watermelon. It, it really wasn't worth it. I mean, the rates weren't there. Product wasn't good. I mean, we, we honestly did not haul any watermelon this year. For now, Arguyin is reaping the benefits. But if the excessive heat continues for too long, with no rain, his situation could change. But we're not out of the woods yet. We just started our harvest season, so we still got a ways to go. The harvest season lasts two months. Right now, the U.S. drought monitor shows that the entire valley is not under any form of drought right now. Farmers hope it stays that way. Live in Lyford, Stephanie Rosales, Channel 5 News at 6.